Isaac, welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. I'm sorry that I'm in the corner of my new room. And yeah, I'll give you a quick little tour after this. So yeah, but I'm going to be comparing my two Polaroid cameras. A quick little room tour starts now. What do I mean by comparing them? Is comparing their well, sorry about that. Comparing their features, functions, looks, and stuff. So yeah, let me introduce my Polaroids. Here's the first one: the 1980 Polaroid Step One Land Camera. It is the SX70 edition, and yeah. Brand new, this thing was $32.99, which is probably really good for 1980. I don't know. But yeah, that's the first camera. The second camera is this one. That one was, was in brand new condition, but this one also is too. This is a 2019, uh, I'm guessing, Polaroid Step 2 Land camera and um, this one is the SX50 generation it's very new and yeah I got this today at a yard sale so the price of this camera brand new it's probably around $120 brand new got it for $75 deal this one costs, like I said, is thirty-three dollars, brand new, nineteen eighty. This now, uh, I got it for free, but it probably could sell for around hundred bucks. I don't know, maybe. My dad's selling for a hundred dollars, so yeah. Looks I'm gonna... This gives off that classic Polaroid vibe where you're just like, hmm. It's a very nice camera. And yeah, comes with a strap. And I actually, this is my favorite camera. But it's broken. Rip. Now here's this camera. Yeah, this one looks old. It's black. But the problems are from the side view they look totally different even though this is modeled after this one the front it doesn't have its famous rainbow stripe and it has a flash on the side where it's supposed to say one step or yeah my opinion it's just cool to have a new one because that one's broken. The old one. So, yeah. Now we're comparing details. This one, well, since it's the original, I mean, you got this, got that, you know what that's for. And, yeah. It has, this is how you put in the film, very basic. This is where it comes out. This little piece right here. Got all of that stuff. Cute, right? The new one. Just the old one. One thing that I don't like about it. The one thing I like about it. It has a film counter. Right there. It would say how much film is it, but it's broken, so there's nothing. So yeah, the new one. Nothing. There's also an on and off switch. That makes no sense. Um, what is this? A power button? Probably for the flash. And then this? They use green tinted glass? The original has black tinted. Green? What in the heck? Green. 
Also a big, there's no rubber piece. Compare the side views. This one has a rubber piece, this one doesn't. This one also is straight flush. This one has that little drop off. Don't look at that reflection too close. Let's look at this one now. They both basically have the same quality, but this one is a lot more scratchier. Hope that's the um, thumbnail of this video, if you know what I'm saying. So, um, for the old one, this is the film that I'd have to get. Makes sense. This was $15. Then, out of the blue, when I bought, when I bought the black one, guess what I got? All this film for free. This is a hundred and fifty dollars worth. I'm being serious. So you can look it up. Ten packs of film is worth a hundred something dollars. I just guessed fifty. We did the math. Seventy five dollars plus all this free film. I have like a two hundred dollar purchase or something. Two hundred dollar profit. Yeah. Yeah, this one's open because I, I use the film. This question is which one is actually not the last question is in my opinion which one is cooler? This one's cooler. Which one is well works? This one. Which one, in your opinion, is more vintage? Duh. Which one um, takes better quality pictures? It's just a back and forth. To me, now I have from one from the eighties, the one that they tried to revive. I'm probably gonna make a video on how to. I'm gonna remake this like I did the Supra. But yeah. I hope you guys like this video, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll probably do some more Polaroid videos like this, and I'll actually take some pictures with this camera, and yeah, and yeah I'll see you next time, hope you guys like this video, like, comment, and subscribe, bye.